Hey everybody, I'm here today with a driving lesson on keeping your car centered in the lane. In this video, I'll be going over a few simple tips for keeping your car centered in the lane while you're driving. These tips are effective when you're driving on a main road, when you're driving on a side street, or when you're driving on the highway. Pretty much when you're driving anywhere. Now let's get right to it. The first tip that I'm gonna give you is with regards to your hand placement. Now if you wanna keep your car centered, your hands have to be centered. Now that doesn't mean that your hands literally have to be on the center of the steering wheel like this. You shouldn't be driving like this, okay? You want your hands to be centered with regards to them being placed equally apart from the center of the steering wheel. I'll just adjust my camera here. So right here is the center of the steering wheel. If you wanna drive centered, your hands should be placed equally apart on the steering wheel. Now what you don't want is you don't want your hands to be like this where they're not centered, like this, you want them to be equally spaced from the center of the steering wheel. That's the first tip for staying centered in the lane when you're driving, okay? The second tip is to look far ahead in the lane. Now here's the thing, if you look right in front of you, you're not getting a good gauge of the center of the lane. And what happens is you might swerve left and swerve right because you might notice things on the right of the road or the left of the road. But if you're looking far ahead, you're actually gonna get a better idea of how to stay centered in the lane. So so here's a car that's right in front of me. Now I see that car and I'm sort of keeping my eyes on the brake lights and so forth, but my vision is actually focused far ahead. I would say the distance from my car to that car, my vision is at least three to five times ahead of, of this right here. So we're talking about, I'm looking way ahead down the road. That gives you a better idea of being able to sort of stay centered because you have a good gauge of the center. You have a good sense of balance, okay? You don't want to be focusing, that's tip number three now, is you don't want to be focusing on things that are on the sides of the road, okay? Now obviously if you can look, if I see a store over here, I can glance over there for just a fraction of a second and it won't cause me to swerve, but if I stare to the right, guess what's going to happen? I'm going to veer to the right and that is not the idea for staying centered while driving, centered in a lane while driving. If you want to stay centered, you have to sort of keep your eyes towards the center of the road far, far ahead, okay? Now the fourth tip is your actual driving position with regards to how you're seated in the seat and so forth, okay? So if I was seated a little bit to the right, then I would end up either veering to the left because I'm pushing against the wheel or veering to the right because I'm pulling to the right as I sit to the right. What you wanna do is you wanna position yourself in the car centered you want your focus your vision to be centered just like i said and you want your body and your hands and everything to be centered your overall posture your overall demeanor in the car has to be centered okay so those are some simple tips for staying centered in the lane while driving now once again i'm driving right here on a on a main road but these tips will work whether you want to stay centered on a side street whether you want to stay centered on a main road, whether you want to stay centered on the highway, even if you want to stay centered on a dirt road, these tips will work. Also, another bonus tip that I just want to address is that when you're going through a curve in the road or when you're taking a turn, you want to look ahead of the curve or the turn. So right now, if I'm, I'm making a left-hand turn at this light over here, okay, and you'll probably get a chance to see it in this video if I get an advanced green light to turn. Instead of looking as I'm turning, okay, I'm looking, I'm keeping my eyes on any pedestrians, traffic, and obstructions that are in front of me, but my focus when I turn is past where I am, is on that future part of the turn. It's The focus is not on the where I am in the turn right now. The focus is on the future of the turn. So let's see if you'll get a chance to see this. I think I'll be able to make this left turn toward now, towards the end of the video. So I'm checking my blind spot. I have my signal on, checking my mirrors. As I turn, I'm already looking ahead. 
I'm already looking ahead of the turn right there, okay? Once again, here's a curve in the road, okay? I'm looking ahead of the curve. I'm not looking right here at the part of the curve that I'm in. I'm looking ahead of the curve. And that is just sort of like a bonus tip because, you know, if you're going and making a turn and you want to stay centered, or if you're going through a curve in the road and you want to stay centered, then you have to look ahead of the turn. You have to look ahead of the curve. Still look where, where you're going, obviously, because you, you want to drive safely. But with regards to staying centered, your, your, your focus, your vision should be ahead. Like I'm still paying attention to the things within the turn, but my focus is on the future of the turn. That's the best way to put it. And that's basically it. I really hope that this video wasn't too shaky. I have my camera mounted on a, on unfortunately a wobbly mount that I have to replace, but I hope that it wasn't too shaky and I hope that you got the tips throughout this video and you saw everything that I did to keep myself centered in the lane as I'm driving. Once again, these tips apply to pretty much all driving situations that you may be in. And that's basically it. I'm just trying to steady the camera for the end of this video. I should have done it earlier, but I apologize. I really hope that you like this video. Be sure to give it a thumbs up. Let me know what you think down below. And of course, be sure to subscribe for more great car and driving videos just like this one. And that's all I have for you today. Thanks for watching.